I gotta keep going and going. I'm trying to cut me a phone, that Chris of yard. I gotta go put the shit on. Time to go open some doors, I'm out of my mind. I'm missing some bones on my spine. I can't buy that little home, I could cause with ain't intertwined. And she took a sip of my wine. What's going on, Shift Team? I'm out here with my homie. Neil. Neil, baby. My guy. Yeah. Always, forever. Yeah. Uh, it's too yeah. cold. It's too cold for a handshake. But I'm out here in Dallas with my guy, Neil. Uh, we're having a great time. We're testing these fans' loyalty on the Mavericks. So let's go see if these guys are bandwagons. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Oh. Are you even a fan? Bandwagon looking ass. Switching jerseys every day. Swear to God, nobody say. Answer my questions. Boy, why you stressing? You done lie so well. But you know this hell. Alright, so I'm out here with Leilani Maldonado. Eh, Vanessa. Garrett Coulter. No, no. Sasha. Daphne. Paulino. Lainis. Damien. Veronica. Haley. Jim. Tomdi. Nana. How long have you been Mavericks fans? About two and a half years. Okay. What about you? Um, yeah, about a couple of years down here. Awesome, awesome. So who's your favorite Maverick player of all time? Dirk Nowitzki. Okay. I would say Luca. You tra you you taught her, you gotta say. It. No, don't Don tell touch. her. Don't, don't. Don 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 Touch. Don touch, don't touch. Luca. Luca, don't touch it. Don't, don't touch the ball. I'm done. <laughs> no, I'm joking. What are your thoughts on the team's direction? What are your predictions for the postseason? They're taking. Hey, Mark Cuban. They're taking. They're going to get another good player. Okay. And they will be good in two to three years. For sure. What about you? Um. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Okay. How long have you been a Maverick? For the past 11 years, ever since I moved to Dallas. Okay, so loyal fan. Okay, and what are your thoughts on the direction of the team? You know, maybe a playoff team, maybe final contender. What are your thoughts? I think they're a playoff team. If they keep playing the way they're playing right now, definitely a playoff team. So can you tell me who drafted Luca? Who drafted Luca? Dirk? <laughs> That's what I was... <laughs> okay, okay. Any other guess? Um... Mark. Mark Cuban. He's the boss. And yes. if, if he doesn't say that it's a go, it's not a go. So. Absolutely. I like that. I like that mentality. How long have you been a Mavericks fan? Uh, 25 years. Okay, so what are your thoughts on the Mavericks organization right now? What are your predictions uh, for the postseason? We are definitely on an upswing. Uh, with Luca, definitely. This is this is a, this is is a like Dirk starting in his rookie year. So we're seeing like the Mavs that. slowly progressing. I would say they're about two years away from being a, like a top five team. And uh, this year, the hope is they are a bubble playoff team, and they've got like 45, 50 wins. Luca, yep. um, addition of Przingis. Yep. What are your thoughts of that chemistry, that duo? So Przingis is still working himself back into the, his like, I guess his uh, fully 100. percent He's not there yet, but uh, yeah, the dynamic is great. Yeah. If Przingis gets where he's at a year and a half ago, we're golden. But I still think we need some more veteran presence on the on the overall roster. I think that the Mavericks for the last couple years have not been a contender, but this year they are a full-on contender. I think for the first time ever that my Dallas Mavericks have a chance to take on the Warriors. Oklahoma City Thunder are gone. I think that for a fact, Dallas Mavericks have the actual team that have what it takes to win the world championship. Rookie Christopher Morris Brown, he's off the bench. People saying he's going to have an explosive career what are your what are your thoughts on him he's, he's been going off this season he actually is going off this season after what i saw tonight i think that he's going to be my best and most favorite player okay i, I woke up chris breeze i think that they're kind of a little bit shady with the nba and everything but like i said this dallas team they're bringing new life back to what should be the NBA. I want to see real players. I want to see people that want to win ball games and not cheat just to win and not just get money to win. Do you think Chris embodies that? I truly think that he embodies the true NBA. Uh, I truly think that he's a player. He's a baller. Absolutely. And, and I see a lot of, of good shit out of him. Ha. Ha. All right, guys, how long have you been Mavericks fan? Uh, since I was born. Okay. Same. Okay, loyal fans. So who's your favorite Mavericks player of all time? Boy, well, can't. I mean, if you've been in the city for a while, man, you got to go with Nowitzki. Nowitzki, Derek. Nowitzki. Do you know what team originally drafted Luka? I really don't. I couldn't say. Any guess? Mm, what team drafted him? I would say the Wolves. The Wolves? Yeah. What about you? I don't even know. <laughs> Luka, do you know what team drafted Luka? 
well, Atlanta, and then we swapped around. Awesome, awesome. Last season, they acquired Kristaps Porzingis. Uh, him and Doncic are, are known as the Mavs duo. Do you know where he came from? What team I mean? No. Any guess? All I know, all I know is he's a Dallas. He's with Dallas now. Okay. That's okay. the most important. Focus thing. on now. I like yes. that. Okay. Porzingis actually was acquired in a trade. Do you know, do you remember what team that was with? No. Uh, Porzingis. I want to give it a guess. Yeah, yeah. Give me a guess. Porzingis sounds like Russian. Russian. Yeah. Where where did he come from? What team? NBA team. NBA team. Um, probably the. Raptors. Raptors is actually the Knicks, but it's all good. It's all good. Uh, what do you think about the current team, Luka Doncic, uh, Kristaps Porzingis? Do you think that they can lead them to the playoffs, maybe the finals? What are your thoughts? What are your predictions? Well, if they keep playing like they're playing right now, I think we have a pretty good shot. Um, I mean, they need to learn for you know JJ Barea and, you know, and experience, <laughs> yeah, okay. but they they they're really good. I think yeah, I think if they play that, they're playing. That's good. Yeah, like they're young. They got the energy. They got the drive. So hopefully mixing the rookies with the veterans, that'll give us a perfect combo. So what are your thoughts on like, like last year it was like kind of super teams like the Warriors. What are your thoughts now? Is it more even? Do you like it? What, what are your, what is your feel about that? Bottom line is the West is very strong and the teams like the Warriors, obviously they've dropped off. Yeah. But I would say in the next, uh, in the next few years, you'll see a resurgence of teams like the Mavericks. The Rockets are always strong. Jazz. These are teams going to come back up. Who's the so, best team of, of Texas? Spurs, Rockets, or Mavs? Rockets, Rockets right now are strongest. They're the best lineup. What up, what up, what up? Mavs 2022, we will be NBA <laughs> champs. Awesome. Thank That's you, it. brother. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. What, what side are you guys? Uh, YouTube. It's called Are You Even a Fan? What's good, baby? It's halftime, man. You already know the drill. Follow me on Snapchat. Real quick, take a picture of the snap code. It's on the picture right now. Do it. Also, make sure to follow me on Instagram right now and follow me on Twitter. It's the same at. But let's get right back to the episode. How long have you been a Mavericks fan? A Mavericks fan? Yeah. Probably like 20 years. 20? Okay. Okay. Loyal fan. Okay. So who's your favorite Mavericks player of all time? Dirk. Dirk. I like that. So can you spell his last name, Nowitzki, for me? Nowitzki. N. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> N O W. I T S K I. You were so close. The cut. S is a Z. You gotta spell it. I don't care. You can cuss me out, but you gotta N spell it. Hey, N O W. Okay. No, it's T. N O I. Mother. Okay, so. Um, next question. Sorry, excuse me. I, I have hiccups right now. The next question. Can, can you spell Nowitzki? N-O-W-I-T-N-Z-K-Y Now it's Sky. The Y is an I, but... I've been from Dallas, okay. and so this makes me really bad. I believe bad. you. I believe this you. This makes me really bad. No, 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 no. You gotta spell it, though. That's a good excuse, but you still gotta... Okay, Nowitzki. 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 N O W Nowitzki, Nowitzki. Woo! Nowitzki, N I W E R S K I. Nowitzki. I can't give that to you. That was terrible. That was awful. <laughs> what the fuck? K Y. I don't know. Nowitzki. K Y. Want to give it a guess? Oh. Give it a guess. Oh. Give it a guess. Oh. Oh, I would say N O R W E K T Z. I did I say the same? No, I, I don't know what I don't know what she said. But I guess. Oh, a big duo on the team is Luca and Porzingis. So, what are your thoughts on that? Do you think that they can lead them to the playoffs or finals, or n none of the above? You know, the West is so hard right now. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I love Luca. I think he's so awesome. He's so young. He's my daughter's age. Okay. And um, I think that uh, he's going to be great. Uh, but the West got to chill out. Yeah. You know, the West is so good. The West is so tough. Yeah. And uh, I think if we we're in the East, it would be better. To, uh, we're definitely going in the right direction. I mean, it's been a tough uh, several years here. Okay. Uh, but, uh, you know, we're competitive. So, you know, we're, uh, we're in games, right? So it's just a matter of meshing together and gelling. And I think that, uh, I think we're going to be good. I think we're going to make the playoffs. 
I think it's a great connection that these new kids have. They have such a gel together. They're doing great. They've got veterans like JJ Barea that helps them get it together. Uh, Coach Carlisle is awesome. And I think the organization in general with Mark Cuban being so supportive, it's going to be a great season. Absolutely. Do you know what um, uh, team drafted Luca? Uh, uh, the the uh, Falcons. The, Haw- the Hawks. The Hawks. Okay, the Atlanta. Hawks and yeah, do you know? Do you know who the Mavs drafted that same year? Last year. But yeah, we drafted. Uh, we drafted full from uh, Oklahoma. What was his name? <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember his name. Okay. No, Young. we. Trey. Yes, Trey Young. Yes. Yeah, Young. We swapped. Yeah, I know yeah, that. Yeah. 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 So. The Hawks. Yeah. Drafted exactly. Luca. Exactly. Perfect. Technically. Uh, yeah. Uh, we didn't draft Dirk either. And that worked out all right, right? What are your thoughts on rookie Andre Green off the bench, sparking it up, having a great season? What are your thoughts? He's doing awesome, and I hope he keep it up for the rest of the season. Yeah. What, are your, what are your thoughts on his game? You think he's contributing? or? Yes, he is contributing a lot. Um, I think he's going to be a great addition to the team. Previously on Summer Lap. Who's your guys' favorite player right now on the Warriors? Um, it's hard, but probably Andre Green. Who? Green. Oh, Green? Andre Green. Andre Green. Andre Green. What are your thoughts on rookie Andre Green having an explosive season off the bench? People are saying he's going to have a breakout year. What are your thoughts? I mean, who knows, man? I mean, you know, it's kind of like with Dak Prescott. You know, he came out of the blue rookie. Absolutely. You know, so maybe he could do the same and just, you know, show everybody he could out the game. Definitely. What about you? What do you think? What is it? Exactly. Okay. Rookie named Christopher Morris Brown. He's coming off the bench. People are loving him off the bench. What do you what do you think? He's loving off the bench and I'm also loving him. Okay. <laughs> off the bench. I like that. So he is so good. Off the bench. Yeah. Do you know what team Christoph's Brazingis came from? Who? Brazingis. Brazingis. Do you know what team he came from? You know, god damn it. I wish I knew. Any <laughs> <laughs> any any guess? Give me a team. He's off the Mavs. He's what? The Mavs. The Mavs. Yeah, they acquired him, so they traded for him. What team did he come from? Though? The Knicks. Oh, there you go. You got it. Wait. Perfect. Yeah, he came from the Knicks. Perfect. Oh, Next question. What? Uh, there you go. 